Now, here's a quick one about a guy who went on his girlfriend's phone and quickly discovered she's not exactly who he thought she was. Title, I found videos on my girlfriend's phone having SEX with other men and what should I do about it? What do you mean, what should you do about it? It's kind of obvious. It says here, I've been dating my girl for around two years. We live together now and I feel like we have a great relationship. The other week, she went to the store and accidentally left her phone at the house. I'm usually not someone to snoop, but I was bored. So I decided to look through some of the, her pictures and they were all pretty normal. I then scrolled down and saw an album titled Nudes and another titled Good Times. I went to the Nudes album. I expected to see ones that she had sent me. When I opened it, I was a little surprised. Surprised, huh? Most of the nudes I did not recognize. I knew she had never sent them to me. The most recent one was taken a day before and I had not received any in weeks. So she regularly sends you naked pictures. That's the thing these days with the 20-somethings. I checked her messages to see if she had sent any to anyone, but was unable to find anything. Next, I decided to look through the other album titled Good Times. This one was full of S-word stuff as well. There was a few videos of us having SCX. I was unaware that these were ever taken. She's taking videos of you hooking up without you, without you being aware of it? Oh. I scrolled back further and saw more videos with other guys. The most recent one was from about four months ago. I opened it and saw that it was with one of her exes. There were several other videos with that guy in it. I also saw ones with her and multiple other guys. This is the girlfriend of two years who he lives with and everything is wonderful. She's also 25 years old. She's obviously found her nice guy and hoping to settle down and get a ring. But she's still having her fun. She had told me that she'd only slept with one other guy, her ex. Just from looking at this, I saw at least four different guys. So I knew she was lying about that. Well, there's nothing else really to say or do. Pack your shit and get out of there. Or tell her to pack her stuff and get out of there. Who knows? I like to know, is her name on the lease or is it just his name? Or is it her place and he's not with, moved in with her? I like to know the details there, but it's over. When she returned home, she noticed me holding her phone. She was like, why are you playing on my phone? I didn't answer. She could tell I was upset, and so she started to question me more about what I was doing. I told her that I went through her pictures and found some stuff. She first asked, why was I snooping and why would I look through her stuff? She seemed pretty mad at me and upset that I did that without her knowing. Um, I have the right to be mad here, honey. I finally told her what I saw. She told me that she'd explain everything. She said that the nudes are taken to boost her self-confidence. Sometimes she will look at them and boost her confidence in sexuality. She said sometimes she sends them to her friends as well to receive bo positive body support. Um... I don't think most people that take naked pictures of themselves and send them to their friends to feel better about themselves. I know this generation are a bunch of fucking weirdos and are attention whores and everything, but but still, come on here. And, uh, okay, fine, let's just say you did that. What about the pictures of you hooking up with other guys? Is that to boost your body confidence too, honey? She says, um, next she explained about the videos. Oh, can't wait to hear this. She said they were not taken that recently, but that she had actually been just been able to recover them, many of them, and she had deleted. Okay, let's look at the timestamp on all of them and see what see what they have to say. She said that she likes she likes looking back at them for the same reason. She said they make her feel good. She also admitted that she sometimes gets off to them as well. She admitted that she did lie to me about being with only her ex, and she was scared I'd view her as SLUT. You think? If you're making all these videos, you pleasuring different dudes, he might have an issue with that. But what I tell you guys about a gal's past, everybody has skeletons in their closets. I mean, nobody's perfect. I get that. Guys have skeletons in their closets, but some take it to a whole new level. And nowadays, the gals, I can't imagine a young guy now in his 20s who is a relationship guy, what he must go through because now so many gals put themselves online, even if it's just pictures on Instagram, it's the selfies and certain positions and you get the point to outright videos and sending nudes and all those things. I mean, this generation, but you know what? It isn't just that because older gals, thirties and forties add up, do the same thing because they want to feel young and, you know, part of things. I really don't know where to begin. I told that I'm okay about the nudes if she was telling the truth. She's not. But the part that I couldn't understand or believe was about the videos. First of all, I thought it sounded odd that she just recovered them. It is odd. Trust your gut. Second, I didn't know how to feel as she gets off to videos 
of her with other partners. It kind of makes me feel worthless. How many times have you guys heard when girls get pissed off with their guys for looking at P-O-R-N? But she's looking at essentially P-O-R-N. Yeah, it's her, but with some other dude, and that's okay. I expressed all the concerns to her. Expressed, say, we're done. She promised she wasn't lying. Oh, well, okay. Because you've been so honest up to this point. But told me that she was upset that I would question her. Of course he questions her. And that she was really upset that I would look through her personal stuff. She told me this made her lose a lot of trust in me. And it'll be hard to gain back. Look at the twisting it around making him out to be the bad guy here. I, I'm going to lose my trust in you and I don't appreciate that. And I don't appreciate that you don't trust me. You, because you lie. She then said that it's not right for me to judge her for how she gets off. This is completely normal and she's not actually cheating. We went back and forth and continued to argue. I ended up leaving and we barely spoke in sense. Should I actually believe her explanations? What should I do in this situation? Dude, if you believe her bullshit, then you deserve what's coming to you. She's twisting it around and making out to be the bad guy here. She knows she's a liar. She knows she's a cheater. You know, and again, the timestamps of those videos, that's very important there, but she ain't got to let me see her phone. No, she's not girl for material. You can't trust her. And if you stay with her, she's going to be even worse. Okay, end of freaking story here. And again, the problem is, is that she's making him out to be the villain here. She knows she's an a-hole, right? This is why you don't bother arguing and fighting with women, because they will twist things around and mind F you and uh, throw emotion into that and everything. And the next thing you know, the guy's like, huh, maybe I was wrong. A lot of guys would be like that. No, end it with her, move on. Two years, you'll get over her.